Morning. Welcome to Interesting Talks with Footprints Counselling Service. Today our talk is nine tips to help you stop overeating. As normal, like, share, leave comments on Facebook and on YouTube or on my website. Uh, on YouTube in particular, you've got a button that you can hit that will notify you each Tuesday when my video comes out. Now, me, myself, I was getting a large belly at the start of this year. Now, some of the tips on here are ones that I used and it's worked for me. So I don't see why it can't work for you if you apply them. Do you ever feel like you can't stop eating? Everyone does sometimes. Our brains are wired to crave sugar, refined carbohydrates. The only thing is, the more we eat them, the more we want them. Catch 22. Try these nine tips to tame your appetite. Number one, cut out processed food. Eat whole foods. Focus on your vegetables, your fruits, nuts, whole grains, olive oil, wild fish, and grass-fed meats. Two, eat breakfast. Studies show that it's easier to keep weight stable over time when you eat breakfast each day. In general, eating earlier in the day can help keep you from overeating. Try not to eat anything within two hours of going to bed. Three, eat slowly. Your stomach takes 20 minutes to tell your brain when you're full. So eat slowly and mindfully and try to enjoy every part of your meal. Four, moderate or eliminate alcohol. Do this to lower your sugar levels and your calories and this will also help you to stop overeating. Avoid your trigger foods. Know your own trigger foods. Avoid them. Soda, sweets, bread, Baked goods are common trigger foods. Try to keep a journal. Number six, keep a journal so you know what's happening with you. The journal will help you to keep your emotions under control because you know what's going on. And it will also help you deal with what you eat and how much you eat and when you eat. Seven, get sufficient sleep. Even just a little loss of sleep makes you hungrier. Whilst people's needs for sleep varies, most adults need between seven to eight hours each night. Control stress. I know it's not easy, but try to control stress levels. Stress makes us overeat. It makes us crave the wrong kinds of food at the wrong time of day. Try actively to relax. Try incorporating meditation or yoga into your life. All of these things is a lifestyle. Exercise. Walk a minimum of 30 minutes each day Add more activity as you're able to. So as I was trying to stress there, our thing is, it's a lifestyle change. This is not something you do from January to March and then you go back to your old ways. You need to be consistent. And the more you practice it, the better you get. It's been said that if you do something for 21 days consecutively, it becomes a habit. When I wanted to lose my weight, I wanted to do it quickly and I ended up going to the gym 55 days consecutively. I don't expect people to do that, but you can set standards with your mindset of what you can do. This is a short talk. Share it with friends, family, people that you know that would find it useful. Leave comments so that I know what people like or what people don't like. And until next time, stay safe, stay positive, and enjoy your week ahead.